In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the unboxing and a complete setup of your Canon Pixima TR150 wireless portable business printer. It's a very helpful printer if you are going anywhere, you can just carry with you and you can do the wireless printing with this. So this printer uses black and coloring cartridges 35 and 36. So let's start with the unboxing. So this printer comes with the battery that is a rechargeable battery and we have to remove all the covering. This is the USB cable. So it has USB-C on the one end and that's the normal USB. Power cable, setup in cartridges, black and color. Let's check this one. So that's actually the print head. That has to be installed. And this is another cable that connects with the power cable. That's a complete power cable for this printer. So you just have to connect it here. That is the printer. It's a small printer, portable. It comes with the comes with the manual also drivers are there in the CD and it has a big manual so let's take it out so this leaflet helps for the quick setup first step is to install the battery so go to the back side of the printer and here we have to remove this part so pull it out now take the battery pack so it comes like this you will see this section will come out here so you just have to first place it here and then press it down so it will lock here and you can see your battery with the indicators here so it has 2170 mAh capacity so that's a lithium ion battery now before attachment I'll show you one more thing that is for the USB port you can just remove this and you can see you can connect a USB here now once you use the battery then you cannot attach it because it hides that so let's install it first just place it here and you have to lock it with the screw here so just tight it from the both sides once it is tight that means you have installed it properly now if you look at on this side USB-C port and here we can plug in the power cable so let's plug in the power cable first So just plug it in here once you plug it in you will see the battery starts to charge so let's see if we can work with it so once we plug it in we have to open the front chamber so lift it up paper tray is here paper output tray is here and this is the place where we have to load the ink Switch on the printer, so press the power button. On the main screen of the printer, we have to select the language and press OK. Confirm it. Click on the start setup. Install the print head and ink tanks. Open the cover. Open this cover, 
automatically the ink chamber will move remove the print head from here to install the print head we have to move this these buttons here and then lift this section up place the print head so just place it here and then lock it we will hear a lock sound next step is to load next step is to install the ink cartridges these are setup ink cartridges black and color so remove the seal place the black with the white arrow match the arrows like this and then press it down the red light will display so remove the second ink cartridge match the yellow arrow and then press it down once you see the lights that means both are installed properly close it and go to the printer display panel so it may take one minute for the ink cartridges to work let's load the paper paper tray is here so you can just adjust the size according you can also adjust the size with it so it moves like this so let's place a for size so right now i'm just going to install the letter size paper Also at the bottom where the paper comes out there may be some kind of tape you just have to remove it. On the main screen it will ask you to start the print alignment so click yes press ok. So we have already installed letter size paper you can also load A4 size and then press ok. So it's going to take around 5 minutes for the alignment to perform. So print head alignment is done. So let's check the screen. So it says printer setup is complete. Click on the next and press OK again. It will display the estimate level of ink. Also displaying the battery charger or the indicator for the battery. Next step is to do the wireless setup of the printer. For that we have to click on the setting icon so go down and press ok click on the LAN setting press ok select the first option Wi-Fi so this will help you to connect with the home or office Wi-Fi network and then you can add this printer in your laptop MacBook or your smartphone press ok on Wi-Fi select the second option Wi-Fi setup So there are few methods easy wireless connect, manual connect and WPS push button method. So I'm just going to use the manual connect. Press OK. It will give you the list of wireless networks. You just have to select your Wi-Fi and enter its password. So select it, press OK. Click next. Select the option use one router only. Press OK. Select the first MAC address and press OK. Click on the next. On this screen we have to select the password. So press OK if you want upper letter. And then select alphabet or select the alphabet and press OK. For number again we can go down and click on that. Select number so use these arrow buttons. Once you enter the complete password, press OK icons, for that select OK and then press OK. Printer is connected with the Wi-Fi network, press OK. Now we can go back to the home button, so we just scroll and go back. Let's install this in our smartphone. I'm going to use my iPhone, you can also use the Android phone for that. 
go to the app section click on the canon print app you can download this app from the app store in this app we have to add the printer click on the add switch click on the register printer wait for the printer to appear it may take few seconds select canon tr150 series printer is installed close this window we can also close this it displays the name of your printer it says online let's do a test print click on the document print or you can select any photo or any document to print with this printer so i'm just going to print this one click next you can also make some changes change settings and you can just increase the number of copies and then we can click on the print icon so let's check the print speed Print speed is good and the print quality is also good. On the main screen of the app we can click OK. Close this window. That's the complete setup of the printer and now we can start using it. If you want to use it with the laptop, macbook, over the Wi-Fi, or with the USB cable even you can do that and you can watch my videos for that. It's very convenient to use this printer because it's a portable small printer and wherever you want you can just start using it thanks for watching